At the end of Bluffdale Drive sits a northern red oak, which is home to birds, squirrels, and for the past week, a 67-year-old activist named Sue Tu Forte. She's been living outdoors in cramped conditions. I can't sit up in this tent, it's too small. Uh. In the elements. But it's dry. 25 feet up in the tree. She's been there since Monday protesting the city's plans to build the Shepherd to Rollins Trail, a concrete path that is expected to cost the city $1.7 million. The new trail will connect the Bluffdale Drive neighborhood to MU campus near the Veterinary Hospital. Construction is expected to start on Monday, and markers like these have already been placed. Forte says in order for the city to build the trail, it has to cut down more than 40 trees. She says that's not right. It doesn't make sense to destroy so much green in order to go green. One neighbor says he supports the idea of the trail, but he says the project moved too fast and needed more negotiation. I think it's going to be good for the common good. I just think there were ways to do it differently to appease all those parties involved. As for Forte, she says she won't leave the tree she's in until she gets a call from Mayor Treese. I want him to say, Sutu, we're going to stop this, we're going to rethink it, and we're going to let the public choose if it's the right thing to do. Otherwise, I'm in this tree. Jack Lee, KOMU 8 News, Columbia.